everybody, this is Praxis. Today was a very busy day. A lot of hours went in. Uh, my, myself, I've been here. My dad's been here. He's upstairs working right now. And Josh was all the way up on top uh, putting in ceiling boards. So we're all working. We also had the excavator is finally back. I guess they had their scoop was damaged and they essentially haven't been here for almost three weeks, I think. Uh, they've just had all sorts of problems, but they've started the leach field down there. So there are a lot of people working here, but there's kind of not a lot to show for it. I guess on the outside front, I, you know, what they were doing, you can kind of see down there, you know, they've started taking down some of these piles of uh, dirt and they, you know, started their stuff down there. But in terms of the house, you, you almost wouldn't notice that we did anything. Uh, my dad spent most of the morning working over here on the electrical box. Um, if you recall, I was mentioning how the electrician, when he finished the electrical box, the first thing that he said to me is, okay, all done, just want to let you know that uh, it's too close to the water, so it should be failing inspection if they follow the rules. So, and then he left uh, and cashed his check. Uh, so my dad spent most of the morning this morning just taking that whole thing off the wall and really fixing everything up. It was kind of, the whole job was done pretty sloppily in addition to the fact that it was illegally installed as well. So he got it all really nicely done, really cleaned up in a way that it just, it just feels better. I don't know, like when I do a job, I like for it to have like clean edges. Like for example, the piece of plywood right there, uh, that wasn't even cut with square corners. We like, uh, went and trimmed, it was like a ratty end that, that the guy kind of like, I don't know, he was like drunkenly cut the thing in half and uh, it had like all these like starts and stops and everything. But in addition to the fact, one end is that thin and the other end is that. So it wasn't even like actually having square angles. So my dad finally got that uh, taken care of. I was working today on these uh, sills. As you recall, I was uh, going and getting all the windows open to their correct rough opening so the windows can get installed because we can't do the roof until we do the roof insulation. We can't do the roof insulation until we do the wall insulation. We can't do the wall insulation until we have these nailers to nail the wall insulation into. So I'm doing um, uh, window sills in order to do a roof. <laughs> uh, but I've been working on that all day. Uh, each one required uh, two at the bottom, two at the top. Uh, you know, getting those in. My dad helped me at the end of the day once he finished up with that. So, you know, a lot of work going on, but, you know, it's just not one of those days where you, you stand back, you look at the structure, and you're like, wow, so much got done. And it's like a few boards got uh, put on, but they all had to be very particularly put together. This thing, you wouldn't necessarily notice it standing far back, but, you know, it took a long time to put that together. So it's been one of those days. But Tomorrow, I'm going to be back uh, and, you know, just finishing up the more of the windows upstairs. Uh, and Josh is almost done with the, the roof board. So I think over the next week, there's going to be a lot of development that's going to be stunning and amazing and exciting. 